Fog again, freezing fog, so it is creating an icy glaze on the roads in some locations. So really good idea to take it easy and be cautious on the roads this morning. Quarter of a mile visibility in Vancouver, even less out at PDX, an eighth of a mile at the airport officially. And that fog extends all the way down the Willamette Valley into Eugene. So did I mention happy winter? It is the first day of winter. We start gaining daylight tomorrow. So today the sunrise, not until 748 in the morning. Our sunset is at 430. But look, it will make progress pretty quickly here. January 15th, our sunrise still pretty late, but we almost have the sunset up to 5 p.m. March 15th, a couple days before my birthday, 722 in the morning is when we'll see that sunrise. 718 at night is when the sun will set. So it seems like it starts off slow gaining the daylight, but eventually we'll be back to a lot more sunshine and watching the sunrises together on the morning show. I always love that. It's kind of tough when it's so dark in the morning. What to expect across the region today. Patches of fog out along the coast this morning. Not seeing as much as we are here in the Willamette Valley. Mostly sunny skies that will dominate. 50 degrees the high in most coastal towns. In the valley, high temperatures in the low to mid 40s. Dense morning fog be slower to clear off in the central and southern Willamette Valley. We'll get a bit of an east breeze out of the gorge going here around the metro area. That'll help clear us out quicker. Sunshine by afternoon. In the gorge, turning sunny. That east wind gusting up to 35 miles per hour by this afternoon and evening out toward Troutdale and Corbett. Central Oregon sunny and it'll be colder today than it was yesterday. Here's a look at your forecast for the coming days. Showers develop again tomorrow. This system looks fairly weak, just spotty shower activity. Highs in the low 40s tomorrow. Friday, a juicier system arrives. So it looks like we'll be wet on Friday. And as we approach Friday night, snow levels will be dropping down to about 1,000 feet or so. So there's the potential we could see some snowflakes mixing in late Friday night. Don't think it'll be much of an event because a lot of the moisture is out of here by then. But I want to mention there's a potential for some snowflakes late Friday or early Saturday. Saturday, we're drying out. Christmas Day, partly sunny, highs around 39. Carly, is it pretty quiet out there? It is.